Well, I'm always doing a little little video here tonight. It's on a uh, PS2 to HDMI adapter, converter, whatever. And uh, there's a buddy of mine uh, had this thing, and the connector here actually it came right off of the board. So uh, I'm just about to re-solder all the pins back on. I got that one just to hold it right now. But uh, yeah. It all came on soldered and the connector literally fell off the board. So, <clears throat> if you have this device, you might want to keep an eye on the uh, on the connector. This one here. The, uh, the connector there is fine, looks like. Uh, I guess that's your power connector, I guess, or a speaker. One either. And you got a USB, so yeah. I'll touch up the soldering on these anyways just to, to make sure they're gonna stay good. But first we have to resolder this one. Got one side done, I'm gonna resolder this side. I think what it is, it's it's they're solder but there's like there's not enough heat. And they do do the soldering on these pins. So I'm leaving the solder the, the tip of the iron on a little bit longer just to make sure that the, the pin is taking the taking the solder. There we go. All soldered well in there. And that's the other side. Touch up the solder on the USB port here, because I've come across some devices that the USB port would actually uh, separate from the board and then cause the pins on the back here to uh, to to fail. So I'm going to resolder the uh, the grounding of the case of the USB port here. So, touch up the solder on these guys here as well. Because if one failed, guaranteed the rest of them are not far behind. Okay, so we're done the soldering on all the connections here. Just to make them a bit stronger. A bit stronger than what was originally there. So now we'll send this back to the owner and uh, they'll do an update video, maybe. Or at least let me know if it works or not. But anyways, that's the uh, failure of a PS2 to HDMI. Connector failure repair. Anyways, 